In this intriguing football breakdown, we unravel the strategic dance between Manchester United and Wolves. Brace yourself as we dissect the tactical dynamics that shaped this intense clash. Wolves unleashed a high-pressing trap that often left Manchester United outnumbered. Bruno and Mount operated as eights in advanced positions, aiming to receive between the lines and facilitate progress. However, the distance between them played into Wolves' hands, aiding in closing passing options. Direct plays towards Garnacho and utilizing Onana's distribution skills were Man United's options to dodge the press. Yet, Wolves adeptly countered these tactics, showcasing their tactical resilience. Wolves' counter-press and recovery prowess posed challenges, limiting Manchester United's counter-attacking potential. Rashford's role as a centre-forward played to his pace advantage against high-press teams, yet he grappled against a low-block defence. Sancho's versatility could prove pivotal in addressing this balance. Manchester United's build-up saw inverted fullbacks creating passing lanes for wingers. Shaw and Juan Bissaka provided width and even operated as extra centre-backs when needed. A trio of Shaw, Mount, and Garnacho on the left struggled to gel, leading to loose balls Wolves exploited. Garnacho's isolation and Semedo's defensive prowess added complexity. Sancho and Eriksson's introduction brought control and connection, leading to the decisive goal by leveraging third-man runs. Wolves recorded 23 shots but fell short with 2.2 xG. Their dynamic attacking lineup, including Cunha, Lamina, Neto, Nunes, and Nori, showcased their potent counterattacking arsenal. Casimiro often found himself isolated in midfield, a vulnerability Wolves exploited to bypass and counter. Manchester United's backline needed closer coordination to plug midfield gaps exposed by Wolves' breakthroughs. At times, Casemiro's wide positioning for attack led to midfield gaps that Wolves capitalized on. Manchester United's pressing intensity occasionally wavered, allowing Wolves to advance comfortably. Kudos to Wolves' all-star lineup featuring Cunha, Lamina, Neto, Nunes, and Nori, who orchestrated a remarkable display. Juan Bisaka's stellar performance stood out, contributing both in attack and defense. His runs and defensive prowess proved pivotal. This tactical breakdown captures the strategic cat and mouse between Manchester United and Wolves. While Manchester United showed moments of brilliance, Wolves' counterattacking prowess and solid defensive lines stole the show. Stay tuned for more enthralling tactical analyses. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe to unravel more football intricacies.